What's up everyone? So, um, in today's video I just want to talk about a cheap little $5 point and shoot that I found at a garage sale. Recently I've been looking into getting a more decent point and shoot. Um, my Olympus Mu 2 has some light leak problems and it's alright, I don't like the viewfinder so I thought I'd try and get something a bit better. Um, but I was at a garage sale and I managed to find myself a cheap little $5 point and shoot. So it was a Pentax SBO, I don't know exactly which one, um, it had a 38 to 105 zoom or something like that. Um, I don't have it with me, I gave it to a friend to take to Europe, but it was a fun little camera. I took it out for a day of shooting and shot some Portrait 400 and I had a good time. Um, the camera does have some quirks when you use the zoom adjust because it doesn't have a spring in it anymore the spring's gone if you push it to one side it will just keep trying to zoom that whole way so if you put it to wide it will keep going to wide and once it gets to its widest it keeps trying to zoom in so if you try to take a photo um, it won't let you do that so you have to have the um, zoom little zoom knob right in the dead center um, but apart from that it's a good fun little camera I played around with it tried some different flash settings some of them didn't work so I have to figure out which ones are which but I'm actually very happy with the camera for five dollars I think it's a great time um, if you can find yourself a good little five dollar point and shoot like that um, I'd suggest you give it a go as long as it's got working light seals and it seems to function properly I sort of put a battery in mine and checked it out at the garage sale before I bought it um, but yeah, it seems to work good. I'm pretty happy with the image, uh, the photo results as well. They're um, surprisingly good little lens on it. Uh, so yeah, I'll throw up some of the images in a video now. Hope you guys enjoy.
So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, let me know in the comments if you've played around with a cheap $5 little point and shoot yourself. Um, and if you like these videos, please like and subscribe and there will be more coming out throughout the year. So stay tuned for those. Thanks guys.